Hey kids! In today's video, we will be learning about gravity. Oh, I just remembered, a friend of mine will be joining us in today's lesson. This is Christiana. Are you ready? Let's begin! Before we begin, let's go to Earth. Did you know that gravity is what keeps us grounded on planet Earth? Thanks to gravity, we stay right here on the surface. Gravity is like an invisible magnet that pulls everything towards each other. Gravity pulls objects like that ball down to the ground. You're right! Each planet has its own unique gravity. On Jupiter, everything is super heavy because gravity is super strong. That's right, kids. Jupiter has the strongest surface gravity. Fortunately, Earth has just the right amount of gravity for us to live comfortably. To understand gravity further, we need to learn the key points. Let's begin with attraction. Gravity is a force of attraction. If an object falls, like an apple from a tree, it will hit the ground. Gravity acts like a magnet, pulling the apple to the surface of the earth. Mass matters. The more massive an object is, the stronger its gravity. That's why Earth has a strong gravity compared to smaller objects, like a basketball. Distance matters. Gravity gets weaker as you move farther away from an object. So the closer you are to something, the stronger its gravity affects you. Every object has gravity. It's not just the Earth that has gravity. Every object with mass, like the Sun, the Moon, and even you, has gravity. Falling objects. When you drop something, like your ice cream, Ahem. As I was saying, when you drop something, like your ice cream, it falls to the ground because of gravity. Gravity pulls everything down towards the center of the Earth. Orbits Gravity is also what keeps planets in orbit around the Sun. The Sun's gravity pulls on the planets, and their forward motion keeps them from falling into the Sun. All in all, gravity is the invisible force that makes things fall to the ground, keeps the Earth and other planets in their orbits, and pulls objects with mass towards each other. It's a fundamental force of nature that affects everything with weight or mass. Weight is typically measured in newtons. Here's an example. Let's say my mass is 50 kilograms. When I am on Earth and on the Moon, my mass stays the same. However, when I am on Earth, 
my weight will be different compared to my weight when I am on the moon. That's because the moon's gravity is much weaker than the Earth's. But your mass, the amount of matter in you, stays the same no matter where you go. Now here are fun facts about gravity. To escape Earth's gravitational pull and reach space, a spacecraft must achieve a certain speed known as escape velocity. Sir Isaac Newton is famous for formulating the laws of motion and the law of universal gravitation in the late 17th century. His work laid the foundation for our understanding of gravity. Gravity causes the tides on Earth. The gravitational pull of the moon and the sun on Earth's oceans creates two high tides and two low tides each day. And that is all for today's video. I hope you enjoyed learning about gravity today. If you enjoyed the video and want to see more videos from us, please click the subscribe button. Also, give us a like that will help us. We thank you so much and we do hope that you enjoy our videos. See you soon!